What's up, YouTube? This is Two Raw Four TV. So, before I get into this video, I want to give a shout out to the brother Instinct Takes for the five dollar donation via the Cash App. He leaves a note saying Tom Brady might unretire and go to the Dolphins. Yeah. So I'll put a link to this article in the pinned comment in the comment section below. So apparently Rich Eisen on his, uh, I guess it was his podcast, talked about NBA rumors, not NBA, excuse me, NFL rumors. And one of the rumors that is being put out there is that Tom Brady Oh my God, man. They're seriously considering unretiring and playing for the Miami Dolphins. Now, to be fair, Tom Brady came out today and squashed this rumor saying that, you know, he has no interest coming back and playing for the NFL and that he has too much too many things going on in his personal life. Now, this is my take on it. Last year, when the reports came out that he was retiring, I think that was prematurely leaked in hindsight and that Tom Brady didn't want to be seen as being forced into retirement. And also, you know, the guy never issued his retirement papers. And then six weeks later, he announced that he was coming back for a 23rd season in the NFL. But this time, I think he retired on his own terms. And, more importantly, he, he submitted his retirement papers to the NFL and the, uh, the Players Association. So he is officially retired. Um, I, I, I would be shocked if he came back and played for the Dolphins. Now, I, I would. Now, if he never put in those retirement papers... I would hold it the possibility that, you know, alter the possibility that he would come back and play because he's addicted to the limelight. Now, is he completely done with football as an active player? I I, I think so. But, but you never know with these guys, man. You know, because I do think Tom Brady has become accustomed to being in the spotlight, being the, you know, it, it's hard to walk away from that shit. It's hard to walk away from that and be a regular person. You know, that might be why he's so busy right now. And, you know, it's going to come. You know, right now it's not football season. But I'm pretty sure when the summer comes into the fall, He's going to see the NFL for the first time in his life since he's been an, an adult, damn near. Uh, for the first time, the NFL is going to move on without him. And there may be some withdrawal pains. There may be some, you know, missing the game and being the spotlight and seeing other people, you know, being given all the attention. So, I put it like this. I think that it's a 99% chance that he's done with the game. But there's always going to be that 1% chance that he's going to come back just because of, you know, these guys, it's hard for them to move on, man. You know, some of these guys, they, they hang on, they hang on, they hang on, and they can't, fucking move away and, 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 and go away from the spotlight. Muhammad Ali hung on too long. Sugar Ray Robinson hung on too long. Sugar Ray Leonard, even though he had a segmented career, he hung on too long. You know, in some ways you could say Michael Jordan hung on a little bit too long playing with the Wizards, but, you know, he came back for different reasons, but it is what it is, but tell me what you guys think.